Bonjour and Benvenue, Oitoe. Okay, for our first race here from Oitoe is race number three. It's the Wild Risk Handicap Hurdle. It's over two miles, three furlongs, and 0 to 140. So number one is Money Goes Away for Darren Thompson, the favourite. Eskimo Jane for David Robertson. Blue Danube for Kevin Meenahan. If you want blood for Martin Leadham. Cop Out for Graham Clutterbuck. Banana Split for Kevin Meenahan. Chief Orlando for Carl Arroganti. Loving Brace for Stu Gray. Holly West for Graham Clutterbuck. Trojan General for Daniel French. De Pallier for James Follis. And Quick Gold for Darren Howes. The 12 of them are already on their way. Let me just start on the turn here. And they're straight into the first hurdle. And it's Eskimo Jane that's going to lead us. Known front runner for David Robertson. Happy to sprint off here at uh, this course here in uh, just outside Paris. And they're already getting well strung out here. As we approach the second hurdle. We've already got probably 15 lengths between first and last. So that, that first turn made a difference. We've still got a couple of miles to travel though, so hopefully uh, some of those horses towards the rear can get in it. But we're being led by Eskimo Jane. He's got a couple of lengths on De Pallia, and a further two back to Cop Out. Followed through by Holly West, and then If You Want Blood. And we've got Loving Brace, all pretty much Indian file already as they approach the third. They all get over it. A couple of sticky jumps towards the rear. Trojan General was a bit slow. And alongside Loving Brace now is Blue Danube. Banana Split and... Who's that other horse with a red cap? It's Chief Orlando. My apologies to Carl Arroganti there. And they're being followed through by the top weight. Money goes away. And then just at the rear, quick golden Trojan General. So as they take this left turn here, here towards the back of the course. Still a mile and a half to travel. Eskimo Jane gets over the fourth. This is the remainder for some slow jumps. Quick golds uh, having to be hurried along towards the rear. They get to the fifth. Oh, and there's a poor jump there by Loving Brace. Jockey was uh, lucky to stay in the saddle. But it's Eskimo Jane. Still leads by a couple to Tepalia. Then we've got about three back to Holly West, Chief Orlando. And if you want blood, Cop Out's in there as well. Then we've got the Greg against the fence with nowhere to go. Looks like Blue Danube. Then we've got Banana Split on the outside. Trojan General. A couple of them got over that a bit slow. So they're going to have a circuit to go, which is roughly about a mile and a quarter as they pass the winning post for the last time. And it's Eskimo Jane that still leads us. Comes out to the left from De Pallia in second. These two have been one and two all the way. Then we've got De Chief Orlando in third. Now they make the seventh. Some slow jumps again. I've embraced and got over it well. But it's Eskimo Jane by two with a mile to travel from De Pallia. And the four flights to take. We've got Chief Orlando, Holly West, Trojan General. And Cop Out, if you want blood, banana split, they make the eighth. Oh, and we've got a bit of a pause here. In fact, we've got a massive pause. Oh, a little bit caught up there. I don't know what happened there from the camera crew. But it's Eskimo Jane and Depalia that are neck and neck now. Somebody just called up. We've got three to jump. Eskimo Jane and Depalia together. Follis and Robertson. And it's Depelia that just noses in front. But Eskimo Jane pushes again. But they've got about three or four lengths over Trojan General, Cop Out, Banana Split, and Chief Orlando. And they're being followed through now by If You Want Blood, Loving Brace running on Holly West. Blue Danube against the fences, Money Goes Away, and Quick Gold in the rear. But Eskimo Jane's taking it up again with four and a half furlongs left to run. It's Eskimo Jane by a length now to Depelia. Here comes Trojan General, Cop Out, being pushed along well now. It's Banana Split. But it's Eskimo Jane, still leads inside the four. As they take this turn and approach the tenth, which is uh, three from home, it's Eskimo Jane. Eskimo Jane rises well, gets over it, gets away fast. But out of the pack comes Trojan General to look like to challenge, but he's got a couple of lengths to find. Still, it's Eskimo Jane, still leads from Trojan General. They get to the eleventh, the penultimate. Everyone's over, and the one making good ground on the outside now is Loving Brace. Holly West running on well as well. Cop out on the inside, in between those is Banana Split, but up front still Eskimo Jane with a furlong and a half left to run. Eskimo Jane leads them now as Trojan General starts to go back well. On the outside here comes Holly West. On the inside is Cop Out. In between horses is Banana Split. Eskimo Jane inside the final furlong. They get to the last. They're over it. Eskimo Jane and Holly West. These two are neck and neck. In between is Cop Out and Banana Split. It's Holly West that just knows in front here. But on the inside here comes Cop Out. Holly West, Cop Out. It's a clutter, but one, two. Holly West and Cop Out. Well done to uh, Graham Clutterbuck. Takes the first uh, here at Oitoi. 
with a nice one two there. Holly West takes it 66 to one from Cop Out in second. Eskimo Jane, our long time leader for David Robinson, ended up being third. Banana Split was fourth for Kevin Meenahan, and fifth was Loving Brace for Stu Gray.